Hello everyone, welcome back to Tank Wars 3. I am your host, Chromoid, and in this matchup we're going to be watching another primary bracket fight between Dragon Slayer 918 and their first fight featuring Ballista Tank Destroyers. Gray Ma Oculus Light Tanks, actually, I'm sorry. The Gray Maulers in the middle, right here. And behind them you have the Vanguard Heavy Tank surrounded by four of the Gray Tyrant MBTs. They're going to be facing off against Owo in their second fight, featuring 30... Uh, Four of these 30 men shotgun ramming tanks and they're gonna have two 82 men tanks right here these lovely little devices and two of the 50 infamous 55 men direct input feed monster land cruisers so with those introductions out of the way let's get this going in three two one begin right away there's a bit of a lull the land cruisers firing from the back, and here it comes. You've got the uh, the shots coming in from the 55 men, and this is the music requested by Owo. <laughs> well, that's an entire land cruiser. Oh no. Looks like most of, the, uh, of uh, Dragon Slayer 918's tanks are staying out of harm's way, thankfully. Oh boy. Well, the um, the Vanguard is at 79.8% and still alive. In fact, it looks like his gun is fully operational. The 30 men's charging around trying to find something to kill, while the 55 men's begin lobbing more telephone poles. 82 men's facing off against tyrants. And there we go. Shots going into the 82 men's. The 82 men is going to get crashed into by its own teammate, but that's going to drive it into the Great Tyrant, and they all have rams, so we'll see how that goes. Oh no, the back of the 82 men getting eaten up by the 55 men backing into it. Look at the length of this shell. <laughs> We're just going to follow its trajectory. Oh no, artillery from above. Oh no, a shower of... Bl oh, that's the, uh, that's the blast cannons from the 30 men's. They've got a hold of... Uh, one of the uh, tyrants. Thankfully, the tyrant got away. These things really are only effective at close range. The tyrant has managed to stay clear and is firing into them. Dragon Slayer was not very confident in his abilities. I mean, he's lost one great tyrant, but 82 men is already down to 77.7% .7 from being crashed into by a 55 men. And I pointed out this out before. Um, I'm pretty sure that Owo is his own greatest enemy in this fight. Got to turn that down a bit. Hopefully, that's not too loud. But yeah, this is a this is a pretty good fight. Unfortunately, an a, a 30 men has gotten the side of a tyrant, and I'm pretty sure it's going to be the end of the tyrant. There's an Oculus skidding around. I don't know where oh no, Ballista just went down. Oh, that's not good. The Land Cruiser in the middle, the Vanguard is still here, still firing. Oh, a tyrant just ate the better half of a 30 men and 82 men's blast. Oh, that's not good. 55 men's are taking some pretty heavy damage, though. Uh, that was another shot at point-blank range. I think that gun failed. Yeah, these are trying to shoot blanks at this point. They've been damaged, so they uh, they now can fire, but they don't have any uh, any shells loaded. I think that might be that... I don't know what's causing that. Anyway. Got pretty much two 82 men's. Or one, one 82 men. I want 130 men facing off against a land cruiser, a great tyrant, and an oculus. Those shots are all basically coming from the disabled guns on the 80, on the 30, 55 men, I'm sorry. This one right here. Three DQs on uh, Dragon Slayer's team so far. The rest are ranging between 96 and 68 percent, so they're getting pretty badly damaged. But I think most of the damage is coming from these 82 men's and the 30 men's. Uh, yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I don't think a lot of it's come from the 55 men's. They have, they have launched their artillery barrage, and that's pretty much all they're going to do. I don't know where uh, the other ballista is. I don't really recognize them. This might be a ballista. I think that's a tyrant. 
That's a tyrant right there with the ears. Can't really miss him. Let's see, is that an Oculus? That's an Oculus. Oh, this is this is a ballista right here. Uh, missile launcher. That's right. Now, don't worry. The song will be coming back to annoy us again. Oh man, yeah, the 30 men's are doing a good job of not. Well, I say that, and then they're gonna ram each other. I was gonna do a good job of ramming the other team and not themselves, but yeah. <laughs> oh no. 30 men's. A great device when you only have one of them. If you have four of them, they become a bit of a problem. Uh, the ballista has been despawned, though, and so that will be out of the, out of the match now. Down to four out of the eight starting tanks. And they don't look too good now. All right, there's a shot coming in. I'm not sure what... I'm, that might be an 82 men trying to hit. Oh, look at that. Ricochet. <laughs> the Tyrants are holding up pretty well. They're just... I don't think they have the... Yeah, look at that. 32 and the 80... The 30 and the 82 men just leaping up after the uh, Tyrant. The tyrants are doing a great job of, of holding their own, but I just don't think they have enough. I don't think they have enough backup to sustain against the heavy armor on the 30s and the uh, 55 men's. Even that one, even this 182 man is still alive, even after being gored by its fellow uh, tank. I am curious. I, I still don't know if the 55s can reload before 10 minutes are up. So if this goes the full distance, we'll see. We'll finally have an answer to that. Is this dead? It's not dead. It's just disabled. Weird. Okay. So that's another tank down, essentially. I'm pretty sure the land cruiser. No, the land cruiser has not been despawned. I don't know where it is. That's an Oculus over there, I'm pretty sure. Is this the Land Cruiser? Doesn't look like it. I think that is the Land Cruiser, yeah. That's what's left of the Land Cruiser. Oh, it's got ejectors on it. It may have just ejected all of its shells when it took damage. Yeah. That's why. The turret's been snapped off. That's just kind of killing there now. <laughs> 55 men's. Carrying the 30 men's around. Oh, they're as much a hazard to their own team as they are to, uh, to the enemies. All right, another tank despawns. Yeah, I think this is turning into a rout. Dragon Slayer's team held up well against the initial fearsome volleys, but I think the follow-ups, even though OO's team has a tendency to damage itself, I think the follow-up is just too strong. The 30 men's and the 82 men's are putting in a lot of work this time. Uh, last time, we didn't see a, a very agile team, and that ended up... Oh, man, that's unfortunate. You don't see that every day. Uh, yeah, I think that 82 minutes done. But, um, you know, usually, usually, or at least in the last match, we didn't see anyone really stand up to the, the artillery barrage very well. Uh, it was just kind of a cleanup job afterwards. This time, aside from the Vanguard catching a huge uh, amount of the uh, firepower, they didn't really, uh, they didn't really take too much damage from the shelling of the 55 men. So yeah, there goes the uh, 82 men that this one impaled. This 30 men might also get despawned if it stays on those rams for too long. Yeah, 82 men's going to take out this land cruiser now. It's it's a good effort, and Owo's entries are bad against themselves as much as they are against the enemy. But I don't think Dragon Slayer's team had the firepower to face off against them. I think that's what it came down to. They definitely had the durability. They were agile enough to avoid most of the shelling. Or at least avoided enough that their uh, their armor could handle the uh, the impact, but their firepower wasn't enough to stop these things. I think this was really the deciding factor right here. These 30 men's, I think they really they don't die quick enough that you can take them out in a reasonable amount of time before they close with you. And once they close with you, they do massive damage. And of course, this 182 men is still here pushing the remains of the Land Cruiser around. That's going to be despawning very soon. And it has a pretty good gun on it, too, from what, I, from what I understand. I think the 82 men is a very well-built machine. You see a pretty fast uh, shell trajectory right there. I'm going to that, turn that off because I'm, I am having a lot of trouble thinking over that music. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sorry, guys. If that was way too loud, uh, I apologize. I, I, uh, I have trouble balancing the good music. Oh, wait. That's the Land Cruiser. Isn't it? That's the va that's the vanguard. Okay, so the one that just got despawned was a tyrant. I am, I am all kinds of bamboozled. So the vanguard's been mobile this whole time, and it still has its gun. 
So, and I think, yeah, that's the last remaining tank on a, on a Dragon Slayer's team. A Woe's team gives chase. Oh, man. <laughs> the simple weapons on the 82. That's what's uh, firing right now at rapid, at uh, such high speeds. Looks like the, t the Vanguard's going to go and have beef with the 55 men, and that's going to mean that the... Oh, no. <laughs> Three men misses. Cuts into the side of its teammate. Oh, guys, come on. Come on. You're on the same team. Don't do this. <laughs> Ripping up the side of the 55 men as the, the Vanguard tries its best to make mischief before it is, of course, inevi inevitably destroyed by the oncoming 82 men, which will also come in and finish the job. And that's going to be it. Owo has taken another, another victory despite having lost about, a, about half of his force. Um but he had enough left to take out the remains of Dragon Slayer's team, which means he's going to be moving on in the primary brackets. And Dragon Slayer, your uh, valiant effort is going to be sending you down to the secondary brackets. So thank you both for, uh, for participating. Thank you all for watching. I've been Chromewood, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.